Our next presenter of the Bold Vision for Environmental Advocacy Award is Senator or Senate Environmental Conservation Committee Chair Todd Kaminsky. Senator Kaminsky's leadership has done more in two years as chair than the previous 10 years combined. Groundbreaking policies passed under his watch, including the Child Safe Products Act, that was 10 years in the making. Bans on plastic bags and polystyrene, the strongest climate law in the country, and bans on carcinogenic trichloroethylene and the toxic pesticides chlorpyrifos and glyphosate. So we have a greeting and congratulations video from Senator Todd Kaminsky. Thank you, Kathy, and thanks to Clean and Healthy New York for choosing me to present this distinguished award. I'm thrilled to say that New York is moving toward a greener future, and we must continue to work and collaborate with businesses to create a cleaner and more sustainable economy. The New York Sustainable Business Council is taking great steps to make its vision a reality by advocating for critical topics like protecting our drinking water, supporting the legislation prohibiting the most dangerous uses of TCE, and closing the hazardous waste loopholes. Also, banning PFAS in food packaging. The Business Council has also supported the growth and development of re renewable energy and has successfully pushed for the passage and signing of the Safe Child Product Act. Making the fracking ban permanent in this year's budget was also important to the Council. And thank you for advocating for worst workplace improvement policies like the Paid Family Leave and Wage Theft Act. It's because of the great work from groups like the Sustainable Business Council that we can continue to pass great legislation for our environment and economy. I'm proud to announce that the Clean and Healthy New York's Bold Vision for Environmental Advocacy Award goes to the New York Sustainable Business Council. Here to accept the award is Bob Rossi, Executive Director. Congratulations, Bob, and congratulations to the Business Council. Uh, well, thank you. Um, uh, big thanks to uh, Senator Kaminsky. Uh, we have all benefited and will continue to benefit from his phenomenal work in chairing the Environmental Conservation Committee um, and from uh, the bills he's introduced to his artful uh, defense of those bills uh, when they reach the Senate floor. So um, it's an honor to be introduced by uh, the Senator and um, New York Sable Business Council's mission is to advance a vibrant, just and sustainable economy in New York State. And there are many ways uh, that we approach that, but uh, one critical way is to address the political, the policy and regulatory framework, essentially that often favors the largest corporations. Uh, we represent over 2000 businesses from every corner of the state that follow a triple bottom line philosophy, often abbreviated as people, planet, profit. Um, and we believe those values are pervasive, uh, that the vast majority of the businesses, uh, all those small and independent businesses that you know in your communities that are so critical uh, to our economy actually believe in the triple bottom line, even if they've never heard of it. Um, they are also the job uh, drivers of job growth in New York State. Uh, the largest drivers of job growth in New York State um, uh, is our businesses employing fewer than five people. And they, of course, um, believe in taking care of their employees and their customers because they know them. Um, they believe in taking care of their natural environment because that's where they live. And so we believe that these businesses um, are essentially like a silent majority and we work to break that silence um, and raise their, their voices. So I'm honored to receive this award, but uh, uh, on behalf of NYSBC, uh, but I feel like there are three main heroes uh, in this effort. So I just want to prop them up. Uh, one uh, is all the organizations uh, that are uh, uh, like Clean and Healthy in New York and all the organizations uh, in the Just Green Partnership uh, that fight every day for uh, policies that uh, would bring about a cleaner and a healthier New York State. Um, second are the elected officials uh, like Senator Kaminsky and so many others that work to advance uh, those uh, policies in our legislature. 
And from our standpoint, with respect to this award, uh, the many uh, business owners who, busy as they are, take the time to step up and uh, sign on to actions or provide testimonials or even uh, speak with our elected officials um, about these critical issues. So I'd like to thank all of those businesses that have uh, been a part of these efforts and uh, as, uh, congrats to all the businesses receiving awards today. We're just doing our best to connect the dots in these efforts. Um, and we depend a lot on all of you uh, to keep those efforts moving along. Thank you.